Hey friends, today's video is all about flat tires and dead batteries when you're off-road. These two common problems can leave you stranded and it could be an inconvenience or it could turn out to be a major bummer. Someone could be in real trouble. So I'm just going to talk about the gear that I carry to keep myself out of these situations and to help other people. Most of this gear you can carry, in fact all of this gear you could carry in a truck, side by side, a quad, even on a motorcycle if you have the right bags or boxes. Like on a KTM you have the nice gear boxes. So let's jump right in and take a look at some things that I love and I re highly recommend. The first thing is have a quality air compressor. This right here is a 150 PSI Pittsburgh air compressor. I believe I paid $60 for it four or five years ago. It's got great heavy duty battery clamps and it comes with a 24 foot hose you know, with a pressure gauge. This can air up a 33 or 35 inch tire in 10 to 15 minutes being completely flat, probably faster. I never really timed other than just generally looking at, you know, the watch, but it, it's a great effective air compressor for a motorcycle tire, a quad side by side. Uh, it's going to just air it up much, much faster. Obviously it's a much smaller tire and the pressure gauge and the hose are here. Just your standard pressure gauge and hose. I know some people don't like the gauges. They think if the plastic cracks, it won't air up or the air will leak out. Hasn't been my experience, um, but if that happens, it's not too hard to work around it. So anyway, here's, uh, here, here's the pressure gauge. Along with having an air compressor, it's a good idea to have a plug kit. And you'll have the joy of knowing that I open this plug kit upside down. There it is. So what's in a plug kit? Tire plugs. I bet that making the camera go out of focus. Tire plugs. Glue. You can see this is a pretty old kit. And this glue, some people swear by it, other people swear at it. To me, it doesn't matter to me or not whether or not I have the glue with me. A reamer. This reams the hole in the tire or your nail went in or whatever foreign object went in. It kind of helps you clean it out in the threader or the inserter tool is it called and basically you just put the the plug about halfway into the inserter tool you thread it through there insert turn twist pull out your tires plugged glue or not it works great this is for minor tire you know repair it's not going to fix a giant rip in your tread or if you tear your sidewall out but for most minor punctures which most flat tires are this will get you back on the road it's great I've had a flat on my side-by-side. -side. I got it about a year and a half ago, I want to say. Put a plug in it, and it hasn't lost any air since, other than just regular maintenance air every few months. But it hasn't leaked or anything like that, and I've put a lot of miles on it. So, if you need a good air compressor and tire plug kit for your truck, your quad, your motorcycle, side-by-side, -side, whatever, get you out of a lot of jams and help others. For battery jumping, these, I mean, this is new technology. I mean, the old days, you had some battery cables or you could pull a battery out of your truck, put it in your friend's truck, start it, and if the alternator was good, it would still run. But modern technology, we have these portable uh, battery banks, these jump starters. This here is the Bolt Power 1200. And you might wonder why I like the Bolt Power 1200. I'll tell you. Let me explain a little, about, a little bit about the kit first. Jumper cables and USB cables and all that good jazz are up here. And the unit itself is right here. It has a flashlight and some other stuff on it. And Pittsburgh and Bolt Power didn't pay me to do this video. It's not sponsored. I just like this equipment. So the reason I got the Bolt Power is simple. One of my best friends and hunting partners, Dennis, has been in the car repair and rescue business for decades. He uses this stuff every single day to help people. So when my battery bank died at the beginning of the year, I called him up and I said, hey, bro, what brand do you recommend I buy and what model? And so he gave me his recommendation and I went with it. And I haven't been disappointed. This will jump almost every light duty truck. And by light duty, I mean half ton, three quarter ton, one ton, you know, big 460 gas uh, engine, 7.3 diesel, I'm pretty sure it'll do. It'll jump most of these big engines in your modern, uh, modern American trucks. And I'm sure it'll take care of it in other brands too. It's not going to jump an 18 wheeler. But these are great to have. Obviously, it'll start smaller engines as well. 
USB cables are great for charging things and maybe the flashlight will come in handy if you don't have a headlamp. So anyway, just three quick uh, products I wanted to recommend that you keep in your gear bag, you know, in your truck or whatever it is that you travel with and uh, flat tire repair, repair and uh, bleh, I almost couldn't say that and uh, dead batteries will hopefully be a thing of the past and if it doesn't help you, it'll help somebody else. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, hit like, subscribe, and share it with all your friends. Thanks, kids.